In this video, we'll talk about how you can play your PlayStation 2 on modern televisions. Let's check it out. Welcome back to Pop Games and thank you so much for watching. If you guys like videos on collections, video game reviews, news, and a lot of cool stuff like hardware, go ahead and subscribe now. I bought this little adapter made by Pound Technology and it lets you plug in your PlayStation 2 to this little adapter here and then connect it to your TV via HDMI. So you connect your PlayStation 2 uh, via here, this little uh, cable, this is the PlayStation 2 cable and then you go ahead and connect your HDMI to the other end and connect it to the TV. Now I will give you guys a close up of this on the PlayStation console and I'll show you a little demonstration. Also, if you wanna buy this adapter yourself, go ahead and check out the description down below where I'll leave you a link where you can find it. Here's the box that it comes in. It has a bunch of goodies in here. It has wires that you may need, some HDMI wires and stuff, uh, some documentation and um, a little brief uh, little pamphlet that shows you how to connect it and uh, what you can expect. All right guys, so here's a close up of the pound adapter. Just wanted to show you guys before I actually start uh, showing you uh, more detail on the uh, television. Here is the PlayStation 2 um, cable that you plug in the back of your PlayStation 2. Here's the other end where you plug in your HDMI. All right guys, so we have the PlayStation 2 cable here. This is the one that comes with the console. Um, this is the, the one that plugs into the back of the console. And then here we have the, uh, the audio and the uh, video cables that plug into the back of your old school TV. So this is what typically we, we used to get back in the day. And we would uh, plug that into our TV and we would get some, uh, you know, all right picture, not the best. So we have the PlayStation 2 right here. What we used to do is we used to go ahead and plug in the cable down here. And then that's it. And then that would go, and then you connect this to the TV, and then that's how you would have your, your signal back in the day. But now we have the pound adapter that now lets you connect this cable to your PlayStation 2. Once that's connected, you can go ahead and plug in an HDMI cable here, and then this would go to your TV. All right, so I got an HDMI cable. I will go ahead and plug that into here. And that's it guys, you have your connection here from the PS2 to the pound and then to your TV. All right, one more thing though, we have to power this uh, pound adapter and need some electricity. So you can plug in a USB cable to a wall adapter or something like that if you have it and uh, connect the other end, the small part here to this section here and that will power the adapter that, that will allow you to get the picture on the screen. By the way, I want to mention here that the box says that it upscales to 720p for maximum compatibility and uh, uses high definition RGB signal and it's also compatible with the PS1 games and the PS1 console. So that, you know, that's what the back of the box says here. Um, I did test it with the PS1 and it did work so I can confirm that it does work for the PlayStation 1 as well. So here, uh, I replaced the charger with a battery pack um, that I have here. So I just have the battery pack connected to the pound uh, adapter and it's powering that. And I'm going to go ahead and get the HDMI cable from the uh, television, which is this cable here. And I am going to go ahead and connect that here. All right, guys, so I turned my television on. Everything is plugged in and ready to go. Let's go ahead and test it out. Let's turn on the PlayStation. And there is the PS2 intro screen. Awesome. So let's go ahead and put in the game. And I am going to pick GTA Vice City. This game is awesome. Let me know in the comments down below if you like GTA Vice City, guys. So. Let's get the handy dandy DualShock 2. And let's see what this looks like. Oh, there it goes. Rockstar. Let's see. Let me move the camera a little bit so you can see the screen a little bit more.
Awesome. Cool, right? Who remembers that? Now that's awesome. Let's turn it up. Surround sound, baby. Now that's awesome. All right, guys, so I moved the camera so you can see a better picture, and it looks really, really good. Uh, at least those screens did. So I'll turn that light off to remove some of that glare. Uh, as you can see, guys, it looks really good for a uh, old school system on a modern television. So, and again, guys, this does work with the PlayStation One. But if you see here, it looks really, really good. So I just hit X here to skip this real quick and I'm going to go ahead and just mess around in GTA here, drive around and see if I notice anything out of the ordinary, but I should not notice anything too weird. Oh man, this brings back memories. Let's get, can I skip this? Okay, cool. So I got in the car. Cool. Awesome. How do I, have for, oh, there you go. Cool. This is so cool, guys. This brings back so many memories. So I'm happy with the Pound HD link cable. It looks really good, guys. I really, you know, like playing these old games. And uh, it shows up really nice on the new televisions. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I remember there used to be some kind of... Uh, Oh man, there is that it? Whoa! Okay, I'm about to die. Go run! You can go ahead and find the Pound HD Link adapter linked in the description down below. And if you like this video, go ahead and consider subscribing and smash the like button. And I will catch you guys next time.